Musaria fits and they will assist Ruto more because Musaria has also its own networks outside. You know in politics, nothing happens by, by chance. Whatever happens is planned, pre-planned. If what you see now happening, that one was planned. So we cannot say really at the Musaria, Musaria was at the Foreign Affairs. We know Musaria is a veteran politician. He has been a, he has been a, he has been a minister for finance. He has been a deputy prime minister in charge of the local government. He has been a deputy for, for short time as a deputy president, as a vice president, before more he went home, you remember. And he, he worked in the coalition government as a deputy prime minister. So you remember, has more experience. He is more exposed. And I think it's, it's more, Musaria is more, it's more, it's more fair. It's, it's a, they call him a gentleman of Kenyan politics. He's, he's not abusive. He's a man, he's a combust man. He's, he's, he's a cool man. He's a cool guy. So, according to me, Musaria deserves that, that foreign affairs. Because he working the government for 30 years since 1989 when the father died and they took the power election and he was appointed a minister for marketing, surprise and marketing. He has been the government all through. So, Musaria fits and they will assist Ruto more because Musaria has also its own networks outside. And you know, the, 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 the principal secretary, principal cabinet secretary, is not in the constitution. That is a creation. It was created by the president. So yeah, it is. It is something which is which, which was created by the executive order. So it can it can go in time. So but the one now foreign affairs combined together, I think it would now it would be moving out with the president because in foreign affairs and they will assist the president more because of his experience and because of his school and of, of course because he has worked is an insight in the government and he has what inside uh, networks inside the government. And the president is. Much talking about the sugar, uh, sugar industry, uh, reviving sugar factories in in Western Kenya and Nyanza. Musale Mudavadi ni tapeba credit yote. Deputy Gashagua ako tu pale Monti Kenya na sema kahawa kahawa. Unona President Ruto am prepare for the future. Uh, role. You know, even Kawa, they are saying there is cartels. Why can't you arrest those cartels? We are there, there. You know, now, me, I read Kidogo, Nasoma Kidogo. Mm -hmm. Now, the international market of coffee is the lowest. Mm -hmm. If it is the lowest, Tell the people the truth because how to how do you pay how do you pay farmers more if the international way you sell the commodity? The, 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 since there I don't know for many years this is the lowest price of coffee in the international market. In the Western you have said about sugar. Not not only the Masario can take a credit because the president is on the wheel. It's the one you know. It's the one now reviving. It's coming out strongly and the going ground and the saying saying that now you want to revive. It's the swine that also I understand even in Bungoma what were what because when I say it is not marketable, sugar takes two years or one or 16 months, 18 months. So you can't wait money for 18 months. When I work here, to come here and acquire a caraca cabbage, minchina, and buy in a work papers because two years, okay, Marisa, two years, come on in one just to go make a So the credit in the sugar sector, it is improved, it will go to the entire government and it will go to the president because they want to spear eating it and it also go, it also benefits the people of Western. It will be, it will be, it will be. Be oppressing in digital size, it will be oppressing and and and, and aggrate it to the people, to the people of Kenya and the people of Western. Because it is now you know the price of sugar is very high, it's around for 450 to 2 kg, which is around 220 to 225 to 230 per kilogram. So we say that if, if, if the sugar is revived, and then those who are taking sugar, or those who are taking tea, those who are like taking sugar, it will be cheaper and everybody will afford. Especially now when the cost of living is very high. When the commodities are very high. Mm -hmm. Yes. Tuliona juzi, uh, your former boss, uh, kuna kitu waliweza uh, kutuma uh, katika mitandao ya kijamii. Na kasema, na nikama likuwa akimgonga the current deputy president. Mm. Uh, wacha, ni, wacha niwana kile kitu walikuwa kisema. Alisema, a man who returns his kinsmen only in times of personal grief mm. invite, invites ridicule. Let me Alikuwa kigonga nani? Ni Gashagua nani? Don't say it's not my former post because he went even recently. Ah, Gash nani Nyambuto ali wewe ulikuwa political yeah, uh, advisor wake? Yeah, I, 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 he was your former boss. He was my former boss. But now uh, I'm no longer with him. Yeah, yeah.